갑자기 내게 나타나죠 너. 난 아무 말. Hey everyone. So this is my first video for the year 2020, and I'm going to do another review. Of course, fragrance review, my main thing. And as the title says down below, I am going to review Jessica Simpson perfume. Yes, I am going to talk about another celebrity fragrance that I adore, 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 adore. Going right into it, this is Jessica Simpson Fancy Box Package. It's a kind of pink champagne rose vibe gold bottle with a little off-white color in the middle with a little flowers running through flowers and vine running through that is basically the box for this gorgeous bottle i do love the bottle it, it kind of like antique enchant look and it's heavy it have a weight to it because of this glass thick bottle i love the cap i wish it was the magnetic kind of vibes but cap is still cool this is a 3.4 ounce 100 ml and i know i had to go through 100 ml because this going on be like one of my go-to fragrance for quick reach so Jessica launched this in 2008 so that's like 12 years ago and this is a nice nice scent to open in the winter time cold weather for us in the Caribbean it's like really really good I, I wear it normal hot sun thing and it's still open up but it's better for cold weather trust me let me take a spray on my skin good optimizer <clears throat> just taking in this scent a little bit guys now this smells so good it smells like to be honest if somebody just spray this on me and asked me to guess I was never gonna guess that it was a celebrity fragrance it smells so good it, it's like yummy like gourmande this is a lovely gourmand scent no lie and I am going to read out some of the notes quickly for you well all the notes so for the top note is pear apricot nectar and red fruits and the red fruits supposed to be red berries the heart notes or middle notes gardenia jasmine almond well toasted almonds and caramel that is where you will get the sugary sweet sweet scent and for the base notes we have sandalwood vanilla cream and amber crystals very beautiful beautiful notes i would say and this is a, a well blended fragrance the the scent everything just mesh so so beautiful <coughs> see it's, oh, it's so so lovely it giving me a juicy cup tour vibe the cold but the good thing is this lasts longer than juicy Couture. and for all those who been using juicy Couture lines we all complain that the scents do not last long but this could give you a good six hours seven hours and that's not bad for a celebrity scent right and then she lo launched fancy love like a year or two after and i think she have other 
flanker right now is the closest to me in her fancy line um for aged group i could say any age could wear it um between 20 to 40 something year olds like yeah it's this good it is a compliment getter i i got a lot of compliments like oh what are you wearing you know that's kind of nice vibes so this is what you guys want to know this is what you want to pick up do not sleep on this scent trust me a lot of people who into the niche in the niche line don't don't fancy the celebrity scents but don't sleep on this this is a good this is a good scent for your money too it's like 30 something us i just adore it does it smell similar to anything i could let you know that the almond and caramel are the top top notes the top accords you will smell like really 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 for the first for the first hour and even for the dry the caramel is like pungent it's but it's not too loud it's just right so this is my this is my take on jessica simpson um just give me your feedback let me know what you think if you are a fan of it or if you will try it and Please like and subscribe, comment down below. Let me know what you want to know about a fragrance before you purchase. And this is for my Trinidadians especially. Because I know everybody in America go crazy for the fragrance and me no more. But here in Trinidad, um, we buy on what people tell us to a lot with the smell it whatever so let me know guys and thank you bye